Hi guys, welcome back to another Minecraft video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys the secret 1.22 update. So yesterday, Mojang accidentally leaked a secret the 1.22 update. So Bavani deleted it just a 10 seconds later, but then someone managed to copy it and save it before it got deleted. And right now I'm playing it, so I can show you all the features that's going to be released in the update. So number one, we have the, if you type in this command slash slash and do W, A, N, D, you do this, and you get this. So then you can right click and then go to here and then you do slash slash set and just whatever block you want. So then boom, boom. So that's just one feature of this massive update. So the next feature is that if we go over here, you scroll down. Is that? Oh wait, is that they added this new little house here, where if you just go inside, you can see all these cool stuff. You can see the loot in here. Actually, there was nothing, and those chests should be doubled. But I don't know why they aren't. And if you, and there's this new villager type of villager. I just need to find it. So where is it? Oh wait, there's another house? I didn't even know this was here. Oh, let me turn off auto jump. Okay, there we go, I turned off auto jump. So, now, let's go find... Okay, anyways, there's this new type of villager. Called like the... Oh, guard. It was like called a... Guard. Okay. Oh. oh, there you are. It's called the Gatekeeper. And if you trade with this guy, you can see the Zeolator and this Blue Journal. We'll get into that more later. But right now, let's just keep on mixing it going. I'm going to show you the next feature. So the next feature is that they actually updated doors. So if you type in a d door... You can see that they have all kinds of like new doors. Like look, they have metal doors. Like look, they have all these new doors. These trap doors. Like you like I don't know, just to unlock to open them. So Yeah, let's just look a little bit. Oh, you know you can do dark modern door. Or you can like do spruce barn door. Or you can just use any pattern you would like. And put on any door. Oh, I can use like, let's say I like the cherry door. Or like the bamboo door. I can apply it to any door now. This is a really cool change. And I really like it. And it's, this is a great change to Minecraft. Okay, anyways, on to the next feature. They also added these new, like, s structures that just randomly spawn in your world. So let me go teleport to one real quick. Okay, so as you can see, they also updated the dungeons a little bit. And now, and if you have a skeleton dungeons, this is what it's going to look like. You can see this chest with loot. Wow, pretty good loot. And what's in here? Ooh, there's stuff in there. And then... Yeah, there's barrels, diamonds, wow, this is pretty good loot. Now, I know you won't be able to make XP farms so easily anymore. Or maybe this is the opposite. Maybe this will actually make it easier and much better. But now we can get more loot out of these places instead of just going here to make an XP farm. So, yeah, they also added different. They also updated other structures, so let me show you one of those. Oh, if you want to mention. They also added these like new kinds of like structures that like just randomly spawn in. And you have another one over here. I don't know what this one is. Oh, I guess it just, it just does that. Okay, so I think I'm gonna show you some. Okay, now let me show you something else that they add that's cool. They also added furniture to the game, so you can spawn these like lower droves and you can like put them inside. They also added these like tables and chairs, so you can do stuff like this. There we go.
Let me show you something else. Let me show you something else they added. Let me show you something else they added. So, so, if you like explore far enough underground, you'll find like a structure. You'll find some structures or you'll find some cool mobs, such as one of these I'm gonna show you. So this is a new boss at Minecraft that Mojang added, and this is how it plays. So let me go to bed, and I'm gonna show you how this boss, what this boss does. So, and, oh, okay, so it's really It does lots of damage. I'm not gonna play too much of it, I wanna show you how the game is done. So when he does that, go to the back. You can check out this. So yeah, this is that's what the update add. That's also something else the update adds. So let me show you another one. Okay, so then they also added this structure, which is basically just a structure where you see all these like these like little like mo people or mobs. And then you see all this, it's like a village. And then you see this big mob, this boss. They also had another boss. Yeah, they had two bosses. And I'm gonna also play this guy as a So. There we go. Okay, now I'm gonna go to survival mode. Oops. Let me try to fight this guy. Okay, so the next boss we're gonna be looking at, or the last one, is this frost mile. We're basically going to go up to they added is that they basically added all kinds of mechanical stuff to the game so they added motors they added all kinds of like gears and stuff and treads oh and you can make ro things rotate now you can make things rotate now so because of this update this update is like so cool it's like the coolest update where they made so yeah this is a pretty cool update. Let me just show you guys how this spring works. So let me build it up a little bit. Or like. And then like. Let me just build something really quickly. This is like a really simple thing. It's something you can really really cool you can do with this update. So now if we put items on it, it's gonna like move. So yeah, that's also another really cool thing for something. So next one I'm gonna show you. Is that they actually added many new biomes. So we might saw some of these new biomes at the beginning, but yeah, here's one of the new ones. So you can see it's like has this like really big forest. It's kinda like the spruce forest, but much bigger. It's called like the fur. And it's like new fur wood can be made in all kinds of stuff. Like we have fur wood. We have all kinds of like stuff like that. Like this is pretty cool. We have all kinds of stuff. So 
So let me show you guys everything. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And then, let me show you another bomb. There's more, there's many new bombs. There's over, there's like, like, there's like over, uh, like, many new bombs. Like, there's over like 10, there's like over 10 bombs in this update, in this update. And there's another one, it's kind of, it's, one's kind of like a spruce forest, but it's not. Or it's like a flower one. You know, like a beehive. I'm like, gonna try to find another one. Okay, we also added this other biome. This is kind of like the mangrove forest. And they have all this kind of, oh, there's another biome. This is another really cool biome. This biome has like all this kind of like cool flower. I don't know what this is, but, oh, lavender. I think this can also be turned into like dye. I mean, like a crafting table. I mean, like crafting table. We just got a crafting table. What does this make? Oh, this makes purple dye, okay. So yeah, that's also another really cool feature of this mod. Okay, so I think you showed I showed you guys enough binds. Now time to get into a big and the b good stuff. Okay, guys, by the way, I forgot to show you one new feature, and I have to make a world for, like, another feature. What is this? Desert grass? Oh, okay, but they actually have this new cooking up there, or cooking thing. So, some natural around the world could find these, like, other plants, a lot of plants, like, like tomatoes, and also existing stuff. So, let me go to, like, get, like, a stove. We got a stove. It's like, yeah, we got a stove. And you get like a pan. Where is a pan? Maybe it's called a skillet. It's called, it's called a skillet. And you get like, like tomatoes. Take off the winter storm, put it on there, and you have the winter storm. It's called the winter storm, and it's yeah, it's basically like this new boss. It's like one of the biggest bosses. It's like the biggest boss in this whole thing.
can actually go inside of it. I'm not sure what it looks like inside, inside, and I'm just gonna show you what. So we're inside of the winter storm. And this is what it looks like inside because he's like his command box. Drops the net, the Winter Storm Nether Star, which looks something like this. And yeah, it's basically the Nether, the Winter Nether Star. But that's not even the biggest part of the update. One of the biggest parts of this update is that they actually revamped the whole end. They added an end update. So let's get an end portal, and then let's get an eye ender, and then let's do something like this, and then let's just do something like this. And I'm gonna show you guys this new end. So they changed the sky, and this one isn't that bad. They didn't change that much, but if you go far enough, if you go far out, like let me just get rid of the ender dragon. You know, so I can show you. There we go. And now this structure should appear. This is when the end. This is when the end gets interesting. And then, okay, boom! Look, there's new biomes. There's new structures. There's so much new stuff in the end that I can't even just explain all this. It would take me like an like hour. It would take me like an hour to explain everything and stuff. That, oh, there's this new tree. There's this new like biome over here. There's like so much stuff in this update. This is like the biggest update Minecraft has had. Okay. So, and look, they added this new biome. Oh, they added these, these new crystals. They added so much new stuff in this update, in the end. Okay. But guess what? This isn't even the biggest part of the update. There's still more to this update. Yes, there's still more to this update. And let me guys show you guys what that update is. So if you go back to the overworld like this. Oh, I forgot to show you guys the new wood types. So we have this glow stream. Like, yeah. Let me do like glow stream. Let me like do this. So look, they added like mossy, like they added like this mossy glow shoe planks, and like they had this mossy glow shoe door. They even had new variants of crafting table, crafting table variants. I think this is something players want. We're well, not real players want, but it's so cool. We have this, 
this and that. Uh, something like this. And that. Like, this is such cool stuff. This is such a big update. Okay, so let's go back to the overworld now. Please, I need to show you more. There's still more to this update. There's still so much more. Wait, I had an end for this. Okay. So, so, we're going so let's say you beat the game. So me. Okay. So we skip the credits. But that's not even the biggest part of the update. So if we like get like a water bucket. What is this? Okay, I'm just gonna ignore that. We put water in here like this. And now let's get some flowers. Because we're gonna need these flowers. So let's go like, like a poppy. And now let's get like a dandelion. And now let's get like a diamond. I think you guys know what I want to oh, I'm going to do. So let's put the flowers around. And then let's do this. And then, boom, and then we jump in. And then, boom, we're in the Twilight Forest. So, there's lots of new stuff in this, in this volume, in this dimension. Yeah, they added a new dimension. They added this new structure. And okay, you can see. Oh, I, I forgot to mention they added new paintings. So if you like go to here, look, they add new paintings. They had like hundreds. Anyway, they had like all kinds of new paintings. Like, we, it's been such a long time since we got new paintings, so I'm just glad they're adding new paintings in this update. But, if you go on top, you can find the, the Twilight Lich. Yeah, I don't really know how to fight this guy. See, so yeah, I'm gonna leave. Yeah, they added, like, so much new stuff. I want to go out a different way. Okay, so now let's go back to the overworld. Which I think you just make the portal again. So let's get some poppy. And dandelions, some diamonds, and this is how you get back. And then here we are, we're back. I actually forgot to mention something, but they also added all kinds of new blocks. Oh, the spring launcher. It launches mobs up, so I'm gonna like a pig or something, like a mob. And when you do this, it like launches it off like that. Like, they have this new block called the spring launcher. It basically, basically just launches things up. Okay, but that's not the all. They also added this block called the cock block, 
which is basically like vertical red, which is basically like vertical redstone, which is so cool because people have wanted vertical redstone for such a long time. It's cool how, and it's amazing how we're finally getting it now after so many years. And look, it works. So yeah, it's basically vertical redstone. Oh, and they also have this glow. Not all the stuff is redstone. They also have like normal stuff, like glow, glow, and also shows you, tells you your coordinate. How about it does look a little bit weird. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that. Oh, and there's also this other feature. So if we get this bottle of like, like if we do something like this, you can get a bottle like this, and if you take like a mob, so let me like make it night. If you go to like night, it's nighttime, and you throw this bottle, Then you can actually like mutate mobs. You can make mobs mute in. So let me just find something like a zombie. Or like a creeper. A skeleton. And an enderman. So if you like, let me just run about the zombies down here. I'm just gonna make all of them like mutual. And they have a chance of mutating or dying. I see those jeans made it though. Okay. So I have a lot of them. You can do just the creepers too. works for skeletons. Oh, it's gonna run off. Oh, that one made it. That one's alive. I'm not gonna use for the Enderman. You can give these all to me together. Enderman survived. Made it. Okay, let me actually show you what happens when the skeleton dies. Let me see what Look, it explodes and you can pick up all the parts. It's pretty cool how they did it like this. And these are like the mutant creatures. Like these are mutant mobs. And like when you put like this is what it is. So yeah, that's pretty much all I, I need I wanted to show you because I forgot to show you guys this stuff. Oh we also have this like spider pig. Which isn't really a mutant, but it's just a still but we still have it in here. And it's, you don't get this, I don't really know how to get this, but you yeah, have this like spider pig. It's like a pig combined with a spider. Okay, yeah. So now on to the next feature. So now let me finally show you the biggest part of this update. So you guys thought that was it, right? Nope. There's still one, actually no, not one, two new dimensions that they added. So remember the thing at the start of the video with like the zeolator thing? Oh yeah, but now that's gonna come in handy. So we're gonna go to like, I don't know, like... Okay, let's go find that thing.
Oh wait, we actually have these these like portal things which can like help you get to these dimensions. So if you just spawn these portals, you can go to these that was actually a true dimension. So let's go to this dimension first. And this is the ever. You can see there's all these new mobs. Okay, so this is one dimension. This is the other dimension. And now let's go to the other dimension, and it's this dimension. So, so this is the ever dome. You can see it's always dawn, and the other one it's always bright. Oh, and they these frogs. Oh, yeah, oh, these frogs. Okay, so that's basically everything in this update. basically everything in this update so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and this new update because this update is so big it is literally the biggest update we have gotten in the whole game's history there has not been an update bigger than this and there probably won't be an update bigger than this because of how huge or big this update is What is this? Okay, it's just copper ore. Yeah, yeah. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe if you like the video. Enjoy the video. So yeah, bye.